Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wine Making 101, the series where I answer some of the most common questions about winemaking at home. We have a really good question today and that is, what is better for your wine, bulk aging or bottle aging? I will try and summarise the key points of that question right here, right now. And if you are enjoying this series of winemaking questions, please subscribe down below. I would really appreciate it. This question has so many answers out there. There are so many reasons why you should mature your wine in a bottle and in a demijohn. It comes down largely to personal preference. The first key point is the flavour of the wine. A lot of experts out there believe that the bigger the surface area of the wine touching glass, the better the flavour becomes as it matures. And a lot of people swear by bottling their wine in 350ml bottles compared to 750ml bottles because there is a bigger surface to glass ratio. To be honest with you, I can't see any difference the size of the bottle would make to your wine. The 350ml I very rarely use. I only do it if I have a wee bit of wine left and I want to have a wee sample later on. I will cover wine bottles and bottling in another video. So I would say mature your wine in a standard wine bottle. They are more common. Anyway, as to do you mature your wine in a demijohn or carboy or in the wine bottle? Flavour wise, as long as you leave your wine for a good period of time for the flavours to develop and the wine to mature and all those notes come together. There are slight differences between the bottle and the demijohn option. In a demijohn, the wine has a higher thermal density. Therefore, it is not as susceptible to temperature variations in the environment you store your wine in. In a wine bottle, it will have a lower thermal density and this means if there's any changes to the temperature, that wine is going to notice it a lot more. And temperature variation does have a negative effect on wine. If you have seen my sherry video up by here, you'll see that temperature variation is good. There is always an exception to every rule. So for the thermal density and the temperature issue, I would say keep your wine in a demijohn or carboy. Another reason to keep your wine in the demijohn or carboy, this guarantees that the fermentation has finished. If you store your wine for six months to a year in a demijohn, you will be certain that that wine has finished fermenting and also all the CO2 particles trapped in the liquid has come up to the surface and evaporated away. It slows down your wine making process. You don't rush into the bottling stage. That way your wine will definitely have finished fermenting. And talking of rushing the bottling stage, what I find personally is if I have bottles of wine there, bottled up, ready, and I try and lay them down to mature, I am so tempted just to have a sample and have a wee test, just to make sure that it is maturing and I want to see how those flavours are becoming. This way, I would go through the six bottles from a demijohn quite quickly much sooner than I would do if I kept it in a demijohn and took the demijohn away. For me, a bottle of wine is a drinkable wine. And that is one reason I don't tend to bottle my wines too soon. Because I'd rather the flavour develop and take it away and forget about it than having bottles of wine everywhere where I know it's drinkable, where I know it's ready, but I should lay it down for another three, five, six months. But the temptation is too big that I just want to test the flavour, I want to test that wine. The benefits of bottling your wine sooner is that it frees up your demijohns, carboys, your wine making equipment. You have not invested your equipment into a wine that is just sitting there. You can reuse the demijohns to start fermenting another wine. And with wine bottles being much, much cheaper than demijohns, free if you speak to the right people and you're good at scavenging, so it frees up your equipment, which is a big, big bonus. It means you can make more wine, which might counteract the fact that you drink it a bit sooner. And also the space element. It is easier to store six bottles of wine in a wine rack than it is a demijohn on the floor somewhere or on a shelf taking up the room that you could be using to start brewing another batch. For me, I like to mature my wines in demijohns. It prevents me having the taste of the wine sooner, too soon. 
It also means that I can go and buy more demijohns, because they're all full. Because I keep my wines in a shipping container, where there is quite a bit of temperature fluctuation, the demijohn helps protect the wine from that degree of variation. As for what you want to do, completely your choice. Just make sure that that wine has finished fermenting before you bottle it, and also that all that CO2 has evaporated away and it's not diffused in the wine. I will be making another video quite soon about when to bottle your wine and also how to bottle your wine. So stay tuned for that one and I'll see you all soon. Have fun now.